In the heart of the Amazonian rainforest, in Ecuador, lies one of the world's most biodiverse habitats, Yasuní National Park. How biodiverse? A single hectare contains more tree species than in all of Mexico, U.S. and Canada combined. This untouched land is sitting on billions of dollars worth of oil reserves. Would you try to preserve it or cash in on it? To prevent this world biosphere from irreversible damage, Ecuador created the Yasuní ITT initiative, declaring its commitment to leave the oil reserves underground indefinitely while asking for the global community's financial co-responsibility in preserving this unique environment. But with little to no international awareness towards this initiative, there was little to no response from other nations, which ultimately meant few to no donations. The challenge. We learned that what hindered donations from countries far away was the belief that preserving Yasuni was not a world's problem, or that it is too far away for their help to make a difference. Unless, of course, the problem affects them directly. The solution. Make Yasuni a personal issue and position Yasuni as a global concern. So, we brought the problem closer. First, we created a complete communications platform called I Am Yasuni, simply to make it personal. Then, we brought it home by creating a stunt in the capital of the world. During the stunt, New York residents started to come and complain, and the media arrived to ask questions. We had the answer. While still in production, we had the main U.S. news organizations already talking about Jasuni. Before releasing the video to the public, we needed to build momentum. A social media platform was created for consumers to engage, share, and donate, and included Facebook pages in English, French, German, Spanish, and Arabic. Cloud was used to identify the biggest environmental influencers in the country and give them a sneak peek of the video. Then, we asked them to share the message within their own social network. Previous to the official launch of the campaign, the video had gone viral, receiving 10,000 views in less than 24 hours. 
48 hours after the video was shared on social networks, we officially launched I Am Jasuni at TEDx Harlem, a theme that examined the notion of an idea happening in one place, but the impact being felt somewhere else. Ecuadorian Secretary of State Yvonne Baki presented the initiative in Madison Square Park video. The next step, transform I Am Jasuni from a New York stunt to a global social movement. To legitimize the message, a documentary was already in the works. Established documentary director Nicolas Entel took on the assignment. It got the support from prestigious organizations and started to screen at the most recognized film festivals, bringing even more reach to the initiative, now across mass media platforms for a total of over 44 million impressions to date and counting. <laughs> 